Thanks for checking in on this Monday. I'm meteorologist Todd Nelson with a look at your southeastern regional forecast and the highly anticipated solar eclipse will be happening today. So folks from the mid-Atlantic states back into the Tennessee Valley actually seeing the best chance of that totality. And unfortunately, a few areas may have to deal with some cloud cover with some spotty storms. We'll also be watching the tropics here for the next few days. But here's a look at the path of totality stretching from Oregon, Salem, Oregon, all the way down to South Carolina and again near Nashville. And and uh, just north of Charleston, we have the path of totality again, about 70 miles wide. So once in a lifetime event and some interesting things actually happening. If you're in the totality, uh, temperatures will be dropping. Uh, the stars will actually come out. Crickets might start chirping. So uh, kind of interesting. And then we do have a wave of energy here that the uh, National Hurricane Center is tracking just north of the Bahamas. A moderate chance of tropical formation over the next five days. So watching that very closely. Now, the uh, temperatures here remain quite mild. The extended outlook, though, through the end of the month and early September, showing that it will be chilling down uh, for that time period. Today, just a general thunderstorm threat. Tomorrow, actually, a slight risk of severe weather as you head north into Kentucky. And then on Wednesday, a marginal threat of severe weather. But again, today, some uh, scattered clouds around midday today, especially as you head a little bit farther south into South Carolina. And then watching that wave of energy, of course, as that uh, gets a little bit closer to the southeast in the tropics. Hopefully, you don't have any major issues with that. But happy solar viewing today.